हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू क्रिएटिव मेडिसिन इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल लर्न अबाउट देन वन मोर सिंड्रोम विच इज एसोसिएटेड विथ विलियम्स ट्यूमर इज डेनिस ड्रैश सिंड्रोम this dennis trash syndrome mainly it has gonadal dysgenesis gonadal dysgenesis is there is it is associated with male pseudo hermaphroditism uh, in male pseudo hermaphroditism the baby is a male baby but uh, sorry in male pseudo hermaphroditism the baby is a female baby but it but she looks like uh, okay in male pseudo hermaphroditism the example with the help of example we will see example of male pseudo hermaphroditism is androgen insensitivity syndrome actually the genotype of the baby is male but phenotype is female because the baby is wrongly uh, interpreted as female and she is raised as male has female she is raised from childhood as female but actually the genotype of this baby is male and this is because of the testosterone which is not the baby receptors the testosterone receptors are either resistant and they are they are insensitive to testosterone so there is gonadal dysgenesis is seen in dennis trash syndrome along with nephropathy and renal failure majority of patients of this patient of this syndrome will have renal failure thank you and thank you for watching